And those scenes that we saw of the crowded train stations and border crossings obviously are gut-wrenching. An estimated 1.2 million Ukrainians have already fled that country. NBC's Kelly Kovieya is across the border in Poland where a large number of those Ukrainian refugees have ended up. Kelly, good morning. Peter, good morning to you. Yeah, the number of refugees fleeing Ukraine continues to rise by over 100,000 every day. We're seeing record numbers again this morning here in Poland. The total number now well over a million in Moldova, Romania, Hungary, and here in Poland where trains are pulling in daily with thousands of mothers and children arriving often traumatized and exhausted. People, as Aaron reported, desperate to get on trains in Lviv and Kiev as the fighting spreads in Ukraine and basic necessities in some areas run low. Here, donations are pouring in from people in Poland and other parts of Europe. We watched as a van was loaded with food, blankets, diapers, other necessities, all bound for Ukraine. Those donations also coming in for refugees. And people are opening their homes and businesses to house refugees across Europe as well. One company here in Poland turned its offices into bedrooms for women and children who have nowhere else to stay. And we're now seeing a lot of these refugees move onward from these border countries. Uh, Germany now hosting several thousand and people going as far away as Mexico. The United Nations is warning this is a massive disaster with massive need. $1.7 billion is what they're asking for to support these refugees as this crisis continues to unfold. Peter.